So uh, Jennifer and I actually, uh, you know, like it would be at a distance know each other, but we've not had the honor of actually uh, connecting personally. Yeah. But before I tell you about this book, I feel like I'm supposed to tell you a little bit about this person. Oh. Okay. I know I am on this program today to release a confirmation and affirmation that this person right here is one of the chosen ones. Mm. Wow. <laughs> Psalm 24. Who can ascend to the hill of the Lord? He who has clean hands and a pure heart. I feel like Psalm 51 and Psalm 24 are like life verses that you have prayed and prayed and prayed and prayed and prayed. And you have said, Lord, I want to be someone who would ascend to the hill of the Lord, who could stand in the counsel of God. And you have said before God, whatever it takes, I I know it's not just about cleaning up the external works. It's about having a pure heart. And Psalm 51, create in me a clean heart, O oh God. I pray that almost daily. <laughs> I know this. I see my knower knows. My knower knows Psalm 51 and Psalm 24 are life prayer verses goals and destiny and i want you to know that you know that you know that the scepter of the lord is lowered towards jennifer and that by even participating in these classes you are invited into actually an advanced training i'm not about elevating people but I know when I see, sniff, feel, hear a pure vessel. And I want you to know, she is going to become one of the leading trainers of prophetic wisdom in this generation. This young lady right here, is going to be one of the leading trainers in, and I used a very distinct word, prophetic wisdom. Mm -hmm. And part of the reason the Holy Spirit is going to pour that on, on her and then through her to others is because she has prayed Psalm 51, I don't know if it's 7 or 17, and Psalm 24, created me a clean heart, O Lord. Take not thy Holy Spirit from me. And who could ascend to the hill of the Lord, but he has clean hands and a pure heart. And so this area about discerning of spirits, about the human spirit, you are going to learn to unpack that in such a practical way that the everyday housewife is going to get it. The everyday mom is going to grasp it. And you're going to help raise up another realm of discerning moms in prayer. Discerning moms in prayer. And how to prayer prayers of protection around families. And how to have a promise prophetically for a child but not control them by your prophecy. Yeah. <laughs> because there's not an ounce of a Jezebel or a control spirit in this woman. And so I just say, wow, this is fun. <laughs> I'm a mess right now. <laughs> and I say that she <laughs> will become, and I release an apostolic fatherly, prophetic blessing right now mm -hmm. that she has chosen and she will become one of the leading equippers of prophetic wisdom in jesus name amen
How do I go on for this, James? <laughs> Reckon me.